From the Lakeville Government Channel 16 studios in downtown Lakeville, this is Ask Mystery with, uh, 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 what's his name again? <laughs> oh yeah, cue music with Mystery. Greetings, everyone, and welcome to another edition of Ask Mystery. I'm Mystery, the world's greatest puppet detective, and as in every episode of Ask Mystery, this segment is written, <coughs> produced, <coughs> directed, <coughs> starred, and shoeshined by me, Mystery. <laughs> hey, we got a great show for you, and what we're going to do, we're going to go back in time, where we're going to find out about Velociraptors. That's right, Velociraptors, a type of dinosaur. When animals, huge, large, roam the earth and... What's that? We're not talking about dinosaurs. We're not talking about Velociraptors. <sighs> All right. Let me have it. What are we talking about? <laughs> Baby We're talking about velocity patching. Oh, brother, I'm never going to get these right. Let's get right to today's letter. And today's letter is written by little James Blondie. And little James Blondie writes, Dear Mr. E, what is velocity patching? Well, James Blonde, I have no idea what it is at all. But lucky for you, I, Mr. E, the world's greatest puppet detective, have some contacts here in the city, and we're going to find out about it for you this way. Actually, I need to go this way. That's where the door is. <sighs> here we go. I decided to give my good friend Bob Lucina a call. Bob works for the street department and has helped me out in the past. I explained my situation to Bob, and I asked Bob if there was any way he could meet me to discuss the situation. And to my surprise, he said, That would be great. Come on down. I met Bob at an area neighborhood where they were velocity patching. Oh, I got right to my questions. All right, Bob, you got to tell me, what is this velocity patching stuff? It's a piece of equipment that puts emulsion and rock down and fills the holes, fills all the potholes in the surface failure. I see. Now, why do you do that instead of the traditional having the guys come out and putting asphalt in it? Well, the thing is, is this covers it, uh, the shallow stuff, whereas with asphalt, you have to have a deep hole to fill it. This, we can do all the small surface stuff. Very good. Now, and how many people then are on the cruise? Is this one, two, three guys doing this, or, or what? How many people have to have to do these jobs? It's a one-man operation. He operates everything from right from the truck. And the process works. Is he, he pulls the truck up, he blows out the hole with air, gets all the debris out, then he puts rock and oil down, and then it's good to go. Once again, as I watched Bob Lucina drive away, I had the profound sense that maybe, possibly, Bob Lucina. Hmm, it makes me think of, hmm. Don't cry for me, Bob Lucina. The truth is you always answer my phone calls. You never divert me. You're always there when I need you. You're Bob Lucina. Well, folks, that's it for this edition of Ask Mystery. Once again, Mystery, the world's greatest puppet detective, has solved this mystery. So until next time, this is Mystery for Ask Mystery. And I'm going to see how long I can do this ending, because my camera operator, he's on his knees, and he's going to fall. With the Whoa! See you next time, folks. This is Mystery. Ha-ha! <laughs>